Hi everyone, welcome back to Technocrat NJ, and I'm Namya back with yet another Minecraft video for you. I know you've been waiting for a long time to hear this intro. Well, I thought that it's been a while since I posted any video about Minecraft, so here I am back with another video for you. Today, we'll be learning something that I really love, and that is. how to add your own images into minecraft so let's get started first of all we have to go all over to google and search for image map 3 and the first website that pops up is github so if you click upon github.com and then scroll down so well there are other versions as well which are latest if you wish to try them out go ahead but for now that i've been using for a long time is image map 3 so we can uh, click upon that to download so click here to download and then it will download a zip file for you now simply what we do for a zip file is we extract it so right click and click upon extract files so that will extract a folder for you and then you have to copy that folder and paste that into documents so i already have it installed and if i uh, would extract it it might cause some problems for me so again i just show how right click and then extract all you'll get the folder here copy paste so uh, let me quickly delete this i tell you what to do after you have pasted the folder in documents so double click on the folder You might be seeing that we have all dot dll files here, except this dot exe. Now your icon here would look as same as mine. It might be uh, three horizontal lines if I'm not wrong. You have to right click upon it and run it as administrator, and then it will look as same as mine. So if it looks as this, let's go ahead now. Okay. So now you have to double click on image map 3 where you can either choose from bedrock or java java will go for minecraft normal version and for education edition you have to choose bedrock world and then it will show the worlds which are there in your education edition view my worlds so i have many worlds already with me but um all of them are in backup So if you want to add any of your world just import it before you add the image in that world because it wouldn't show unless it's there in view my worlds. Okay, so let's choose Peace Pala into Minecraft and many of you who have watched my vlogs must be knowing what Peace Pala is and if you don't go ahead check it out and it's right there at the top right corner. Okay, let's move on. So peace pull into Minecraft and then I have chosen this world double click Okay So now I have to add the images I'll click upon open and I'll be choosing let's say this image This was the day where we had the uh workshops wherein we had Katya uh Mr Pekka Ali we had my teammate uh Maria and also people from DW Sari It was a fun day. So let's add that image. So it says width 1 height 1. Now that's practically impossible because that means only one block in Minecraft. And th that looks so weird, you know, just having one block with a tiny image on that. So for that we have an option to increase the width and the height. And then you have to click upon confirm. So now as you can see we have all the maps ready so we just have to click upon send all to world Now while you're doing this process make sure that your world is closed because if it will be opened then you might not be able to see the images in your world So just an advice that close the world while you're doing this process And now as you've sent the chest to the world of images click upon play All right so the world has opened up exactly at the place where this image was taken so here we have the chests let let us place them one by one next to each other just like the the inventory so now in order to place the images we need to get a few blocks 
first of all let's get taco wood planks and then we need item frame so as it is 8 by 8 that means 8 blocks on each side so it will be like 1 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 then left 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 and then down 2 3 4 5 6 7 8 now let's quickly fill this up all right let's add the item frame over this and in that we'll be adding the images that we have taken from image map 3 all right so now we're done let's go ahead and get the images so we have to grab the first eight that are given here and then we'll be putting them one by one in the item frames so here we go one two three four five six seven and eight and lastly nine oops i guess we missed one layer so before we miss on more images let's add that as well so we need to add another layer of item frames and then the last image right here perfect so now we'll be taking layer by layer and quickly finishing this so i'll meet you in a second and there you go here is the image and i hope you liked the video thank you so much for watching and i'll see you in another tutorial if you have any doubts regarding what we learned today go ahead drop it down in the comment section and i'll surely answer to your doubts thank you so much again for watching and i'll see you in yet another minecraft video till then have a nice day bye bye